Good morning, ladies and gents. Welcome back into the channel. I hope you guys are doing well. It's a Monday. It's a new week for crypto, new things to explore. So we're going to check out a bit of uh, news in this video, some big key news. Also, something very important happened, which you must keep yourself safe from to prevent yourself from losing potentially thousands of dollars in the future. So um, overall, crypto markets looking a little bit rocky here. We've got a mixture of red and green. Bitcoin is sitting at 26.7K. Are we going to hopefully see 30K in October? I really do hope so it could be amazing um but look guys mark cuban recently just got hacked 870k worth someone spotted some very peculiar activity over here on the uh at the scan side of things or whichever um site they're looking at here but mark cuban was tremendously of course peed off about this um i would be very peed off that's a lot of money doesn't matter how much money you have this is a big red flag so keep your stuff safe keep your crypto safe please this happened from a hot wallet we can see mark cuban confirmed that he was hacked but he doesn't know precisely how he was hacked it was probably some silly rookie error that we all make from time to time where you click a link and you accidentally exploit yourself it happens guys especially public figures out there we get bombarded with phishing emails and all sorts so we have to be very careful about what we click um but that goes to anybody be careful about what you click don't trust some random guy that messaged you right um and always back your um, portfolio up with a ledger get yourself a ledger guys this is so important if you have a ledger link it to your metamask this will help you be much much more secure so you can't move any funds out of your metamask without using the tangible ledger device so we can say yeah the wallet was inactive for 160 days right here and then all the assets just mysteriously moved so according to the transaction history on etherscan several batches of assets such as usd coin tether and lido staked were suddenly withdrawn from the wallet within a 10 minute window imagine that you wake up you check your wallet it's just you know it's all gone i would be mortified However, a few hours later, Cuban confirmed to DL News that he had gone on MetaMask for the first time in months and vaguely suggested that the hacker or hackers may have been watching and waiting for a moment to pounce. Cuban added that he had transferred any remaining assets to Coinbase custody, essentially confirming that the 2 million USDC transaction was actually him. So remember guys, hot wallets and you know things like soft wallets as well, storing online, whether it's an exchange, metamask wallet you are not 100 percent safe you've got to keep that seed phrase fully safe and remember never digitally store your seed phrase never write that down on your computer keep your seed phrase somewhere on a piece of paper put it in some vault put it somewhere no one in the world knows how to get to it except you and yeah that's crazy that's number one and number two get yourself a ledger 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 that will keep you even more secure and safe another cool thing adrian promoted bitcoin on national tv that is pretty cool um basically really bullish to present bitcoin and talk about bitcoin live i mean i think it's such a cool thing to do you must feel like such a badass talking about crypto on the news whilst everyone is just earning like you know money which just forever goes down in value um what else has been interesting this is interesting remember this guys good old throwback to when nine trillion asset manager blackrock ceo said crypto is digital gold and bitcoin is an international asset and also i do believe the role of crypto is um it is it is it digitalizing gold digitalizing gold it's a liquid commodity remember guys i don't have an affiliate link to this but just explore the metamask ledger explore getting yourself a ledger do some research on the ledger you can see the ledger website is right here people that need to keep your crypto secure when you start getting in the six figures territory or wherever you are even five figures you should always have a ledger this keeps you primarily protected hey ledger you better you better reach out to me after doing this <laughs> chain link right recently we had chain link pump in the markets quite nicely quite an exponential pump here on the seven days by the way guys if you're new to the channel subscribe like comment i also have a discord down below in the links section please join the jacob crypto clan discord so you could also enjoy some potential juicy trading signals and just hang out with one of the fastest crypto discords that is growing right now and a great bunch of people thanks for being there everybody you guys are brilliant uh but yeah chaining up to six dollars 55 it's been a while uh it was trading at six dollars 12 just yesterday so we are seeing a good pump here the depository trust and clearing corporation the world's largest security settlement system processes two plus quadrillion annually is exploring 
Chainlink CCIP to unlock tokenized asset interoperability. Bullish. Bullish. <laughs> so that's some bullish stuff right there. Um, but I would share it with you guys as it's just sometimes important to talk about things like this. Chainlink overall does look good for me. We're in this orange phase here. We are trading in a very, very macro horizontal channel. But when we move into the 15 minute time frame here, it could have a potential bull flag. But, you know, there's every chance that we could also just lose this support level entirely and fall back down to $6.33. Bearish scenario, we test $6.25, $6.33. Bullish scenario, we break out once again. And uh, I suppose we could just take the flagpole here of this bull pennant. And we could potentially see a $7 chain link if the market does flip bullish in October. That would be fantastic. What else is happening? More and more Elon Musk crypto scams are appearing on TikTok and other sort of areas, you know, Instagram. If you see Elon Musk looking suspicious or saying weird things online, it's probably because it's not him. So be careful, you get lots of deep fakes, you get lots of like AI scams, loads of bots and impersonator accounts of Elon Musk, like parody accounts. If they're talking about crypto, trying to get you to do something, or there's a giveaway or an airdrop or anything that entices you to click, it's not going to be Elon Musk. Think about it, guys. Elon Musk is a freaking billionaire. He doesn't need a single dime, quarter or nickel from any of you. And uh, yeah, stay away from any weird Elon Musk stuff right now. Overall, we're bit, looking at Bitcoin, you know, things are looking good. 26.7K for the OG Bitcoin. And it looks like it's uptrending quite nicely on the weekly time frame here. We've got a nice ascending channel looking pretty good. BLX chart, we're still just hovering in the green ribbon area of the logarithmic regression chart, which does reflect to me a point of interest in the sense that we are still in an undervaluation zone. Good for dollar cost averaging. We're not in the red ribbon. So we're looking pretty good where we currently are. And if we move into the daily here, we can see every time we come down to this 25k support threshold 25 here 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 you get the gist there's a bunch of 25k levels here that we just tap into and then recoil out of so there's a load of support at $25,000 so we got rejected at 26.8 but we could see some bullish continuation perhaps bitcoiners bitcoin alternative out there i've bought into this one $850 not financial advice uh bitcoin bsc this is a pre-sale an ico that's already raised 2.7 million dollars i've got a six million dollar hard cap target check this one out i am staking mine so i've already got 2.7k rewards waiting for me to unlock when i vest them, which i can't wait to do but overall bitcoin bsc is a green bup20 version of bitcoin and you can buy them at one dollar as a new bitcoin looks really cool stake to iron protocol here you're gonna get some nice apy like i say you can see a decent apy of 191 percent over here at the moment and it's gonna get listed soon on dexes and stuff so Overall, it could be a good pre-sale with a nice speculation to do a bit of a pump once it goes live, like the Bitcoin 20 pre-sale did. If you want to buy this one, there is a link right down below where you can, of course, convert either BNB or Ethereum or Tether into your desired quantity of Bitcoin BSC tokens. Do check it out and give it a little bit of love down below. Um, moving on, just kind of surfing through the crypto sphere. We've got a 1.06 trillion market capital today. Bitcoin is looking good. Pumpers in the 24 hours. We've got Chainlink, Oasis, ApeCoin starting to make some moves again. Injective, Casper. So mostly the top 100 coins are demonstrating movement. Optimism, what a great coin right there. Seven week performance, we've got Toncoin, Rune, Maker, Ave. V chain, so here's a few coins to be looking at. You know, they're picking up traction now, so think of what they could pick up in the real bull run. Could be crazy. Crypto Fear and Greed Index was sitting at 46 at the moment, everybody. So, still, you know, quite a bit of fear in the markets, not a terrible amount, but it certainly does exist. And can we see a good October for Bitcoin? I'd love to think so. What is that noise? Sorry, I thought it was thunder outside. Anyway, to bring you back, sorry, I distracted you. October looks particularly green historically. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven green. One, two, three, kind of not so green. So 70% of Octobers are pretty good. Fingers crossed we can see something nice happen here for Bitcoin in October. Uh, I would really love to see that. And by the way, guys, do check out my links 
to the exchanges if you want to sign up to the MEXC exchange right here. Um, it's one of my favorites right now for doing futures trading, no KYC, which is brilliant if you want to keep yourself sort of the anonymous, decentralized crypto way. And yeah, really, really low fees overall. So check out MEXC, love the exchange, loads of pairs, fantastic on the trading side. And if you are new here, do subscribe, like, comment on this video, and of course, get yourself into the Jacob Crypto Clan. I kid you not, we cost less than a Starbucks coffee. If you want to pay for the premium side, I mean, you don't even have to, that's completely fine. But look, I made this little ad yesterday just showing you guys Starbucks. You can go waste your money on all that. I bet you some of you guys are buying a couple coffees a week and we're all guilty for it. Um, but you could just become a Discord member. 66 pence per day. Um, you're going to get some great benefits. And like I say, you could be also unlocking these nice trading signals, which would hopefully pay off that membership anyway, which is far less than buying coffees on a consecutive basis. Anyways, thanks so much, guys. You are all the best. Um, if you are here and you're new, just hit that subscribe button. It really helps. And I know because YouTube tells me that like 90% of people don't subscribe, which means you all either hate me or you just can't be bothered to <laughs> click that button. Just, just click that button guys i'm begging i'm actually begging at this point no i'm not really um i'm all i'm a long time guy i think you know the crypto space is beautiful but overall uh my goal is to build the number one discord in the world i want to create a community where people are happy and learning and thriving and that is my goal it's it's a competition now I, I need to get there anyway see you soon bye for now stay blessed and have a wonderful day <laughs>